Santosha family, Hillary and Humphrey, we miss you guys. We're going to do a 30 minute power it out hot class. So great, not weight bearing on the hands, we're not doing flows, downward dogs really, just um, 30 minutes that you're going to be able to jump into your day at the beginning of your day, start your day, the end of your day, middle of your day. Okay, so come to a comfortable seat and close your eyes and it's going to be kind of classical back Bikram style, but um, Hillary style for those of you that have been to my hot classes before. Um, and uh, just modify what you need, do what you can. And it seems like it's going to go pretty fast, but this 30 minutes is going to be really powerful that you can just step into your day at any time. Okay. Come to a comfortable seat, put your hands down on your thighs. I'm going to let Humphrey just chill in and out. He kind of roams in the room and roams up. Take a great big inhale breath through your nose and big exhale through your mouth. Big inhale breath. Big exhale. One more. Great big inhale. Big exhale. Draw your hands into prayer into heart center. Bow your chin into your chest, into your heart. Find your word for today. And this can be absolutely anything. The happiness in your life depends on the quality of your thoughts. So, taking this time for yourself, so powerful. Create a mantra, put an I am in front of your word and say it three times. And we'll close practice with that as well. Raise your chin, blink your eyes open. Have an awesome class. Come to stand into mountain pose, Tadasana. Feet hip distance apart and parallel. So as you arrive in your mountain, fan your toes out. Okay, so the feet, all four corners of the feet nice and even. Roll your shoulder blades back, really powerful, strong mountain. Brighten up your fingers. We're going to start with breath, pranayama. This is life force chi. So go as deep and full as you can. Okay, inhale, reach up. Through the nose, mouth closed. Sides of the waist get long. Reach up, stretch up, palms meet at the top. And then big exhale through the mouth. Ha. Press into both hands evenly. Interlace the fingers at the heart. Pushing everything out the bottom. Fingers stretch, arms stretch, chin rest down. Inhale, reach up. Going a little bit deeper and fuller each time. Reach up, stretch up, sip up higher. You might do a little upper back bend. See how you feel. Opening up the ring, rib cage in the lungs, and then big exhale out. Huh? Inhale, reach up through the nose, mouth closed. Sides of the waist get long. Reach up, stretch up, sip up, up and over. Big let go. Huh? Just two more for today. Inhale, reach up. Deeper you go, fuller you go. The easier and more benefits you'll experience. Reach up. Up and over. Big let go hop. Last one, biggest, best one yet. Go for it. Inhale, reach up. Reach up. Up and over. Let go hop. Bring your palms back open for mountain pose. Draw your shoulder blades back. Close your eyes. Take an inhale breath through your nose. And a big exhale through your mouth. Right. Here we go. Blink your eyes open. On your inhale, reach up, get tall. Interlace your fingers. Point your fingers, cross thumbs, cross, reach up, get tall. Tummy and lengthen your tailbone down. Shiva grip, strong energy. Reach up as tall as you can, up and over to the right. Chin, pull your right shoulder forward. Okay. Now we're going to get into the right left side of the brain. Transfer your weight to your left foot. Pop your left leg. Invite your right foot to float up. Then get playful. Tell yourself, I can. Can you tip me to the toe down if you feel a little imbalanced? I can. I can balance. Close your eyes. Oh yeah. Tip over. Who cares? Get back in. I can for three. I can two and one. Good job. Right foot down. Arms back to center. Bend your elbows and knees, stretch up, get tall. Change your grip with the opposite knuckles of thumb in front. Feels funky and weird, but you'll be fine. Stretch up tall. Tummy in, lengthen your tailbone down. Reach up, 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 over to the left. Reach your left feet tall. Lift your chin, pull the left shoulder forward. This is an awesome 30 minute class to do to start your day, middle of your day to get energized. Lift your chin, guide your weight to the right foot, pop your right leg, lift your left foot up. Then tell yourself, I can in everything you do in your life. 
I can balance, get playful, close your eyes. <laughs> no judgment. For three, I can. Two, I can. And one, lower the foot down. Arms out wide to the side, big wide hands. Place them in your pretend back pockets. Bend your knees, guide your hips forward, roll your shoulder blades back and lift your chest and heart up and over. Melt into your standing back. If you feel good, you know you are. Go for it, walk your hands down your hamstring. You might take it, kick it back, big room style, arms above. Make this your practice, this is your journey. My words are just a guide. As you go over, close your teeth. When you close your teeth, you kick your metabolism into high gear. Okay, powerful. The back bend mantra is really awesome, it's my favorite. And what it speaks to is knowing all that you have, all that you need is within you now. The answer is the guidance, the courage, oh gosh, the adaptability right now. Tell yourself, I am enough. Go a little deeper for three, two, and one. Coming back up to center. Interlace your fingers behind you. Roll your shoulders behind your back. Bend your knees, tuck your tummy, forward fold, tip upside down. Have a generous bend to your knees. Take your left hand on the outside of your right foot. Right leg will straighten, left knee will bend. Right hand can journey up to the sky. Right hand might chill out on your back. Might wiggle into the inner upper left thigh. Let your neck and your head relax. My binders, you know who you are. Put your hands on your top left hip. If that's crazy business, don't do it. But be here now. Take a full conscious breath. Inhale. Let go. Three, two, and one. Back to the other side. Same, same other side. Right hand on the outside of your left foot. Okay. Roll the shoulder blade back. This is an upside down twist. We're starting to detoxify upside down. Like a pretzel. Okay, look up over that left shoulder. I'm working through a shoulder injury, and so I'm going to modify by staying here. But you can raise that left arm up. Left hand can rest on your back. Put your neck and your head relax. Close your eyes. And go have a Good boy. And then take a full conscious breath. In it. Let's go. Be here now. Exactly where you're supposed to be. For three, two, and one. Come back into center. Make peace fingers. Take hold of your big toes. Little hooks. Elbows up to the right, left side. Give your head a little yes and a no. Press into your big toe mound. Start to straighten your knees and your hips up. If you're flexible, you know who you are. Wrap your forearms behind your calf. Take hold of the elbows. Melt your nose in between your shin bones. Or you might want to bring your feet together. Kick it back, beat from style. You know who you are. Take your heels, look up. Whatever feels most natural for you, do that. This is where we manifest a lot of stress. Hips, hamstrings, neck, shoulders. So let it go. For three. Relax, two, and one. Release the fingertips out in front. Check out your feet, they're hip distance and parallel. Here we go, chair pose, ukutasana. Take the fingers forward and up, reach up, get tall. Sit back into your chair, weight goes back in the heels. Fan your toes up. So pretend I'm pushing your hip flexors back. Core strong, building the heat, the fire, the tapas, okay? Turn your palms so they face me, draw them out in front of you, parallel to your back. Pull the shoulders back, lift the chest slightly, sit a little bit lower into your chair, okay? Now. Your words are powerful. That's the one thing you own. You're the only one that can choose what you say. So, bringing this three-part mantra into your day, into your life. Now say it, don't be shy. Repeat after me. I am patient, say it. I am determined, I am strong. Sit a little bit lower for three, a little lower two, and one, come back up to center. Arms are strong, shoulders back, tummy tight. Line up under the balls of your toes. Dippy dippy toes as high as you can. Ankles might shake a little bit, get strong. Strong arms, shoulders back, tummy tight, start to bend your knees. Let the legs shake a little bit. In your own eyes, mind, I am patient, I am strong. The turn. Three. On the toes, two. Lower the knees. And one. Come back up to center. Lower the heels down with control. Bring your feet in a little bit closer together. Keep the arms strong. Come up a little bit on your toes. Squeeze your thighs and knees together. Knees kiss. Arms strong, shoulders back, tummy tight. Pretend there's a helium balloon gliding you up, glide down your imaginary wall. Push the knees forward and down. Okay? Don't let the hips go below the knees. Hover that sweet spot just above. I am patient. I am strong. I'm determined. Effortless and easy. For three, two, one. Come up slow, slow, slow. Take one sweet step to the side. Come back into your mountain pose. This is your work. I call it the magic. Inhale like a wave in. Relaxing wave out. Wave in. Wave out. All right, bring your feet together to touch. Now 
we're gonna twist. When we twist, we detoxify, okay? So feet together, knees squeeze together. Sweep so the fingers forward, not reach up, get tall, er, <laughs> sit back into your chair, weights in the heels. Hands into prayer in the heart center. As you inhale, heart to thumbs, lengthen your spine, engage your core, left elbow, right knee, look down, two knees in one line. Use that elbow to push in the knee, turn and twist, look over the right shoulder. Okay, keep guiding that left hip bone back, pretend my hands in front of your knees. Open up your wings if you like. My high crescent twisters, you hover that left foot and shoot that left leg back. Okay, so a little lower to your chair. Lift the chin a little more for three, two, and one. Come back into center, fingertips touch down. Halfway lift to real line. Exhale, release. Okay, same thing, other side. Sweep the fingers forward and up, reach up, get tall. Sit back in your chair. Hands in prayer in the heart center. Inhale, heart to thumbs, lengthen your spine, engage your core. Right elbow, left knee. Use that elbow like a lever. Keep guiding that right knee back. Start to turn and twist up over the left shoulder. Open your wings. I'm going to modify by putting that left hand on that left knee. Left hand at your low spine, sacrum, turn to twist. Sit a little lower for three. A lower, two, and one. Come back into center. Fingertips touch down. Halfway lift, real left. Exhale, release. Inhale, reach up. Bring in all the good stuff. Hands in prayer, hands in turn. One sweet step to the side, mountain pose, Tadasana. Okay, inhale, wave in. Relax and wave out. Wave in and wave out. Come to the top of your mat. Feet of distance in parallel. Inhale, reach up, get tall. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Realign your spine, flat back. Exhale, bring it Take a wide step back with your right leg. Plant your right foot down parallel to the back of the mat, warrior two. 90 degree angle in your front left knee. Sweep the right fingertips forward up around. Strong, powerful Virabhadrasana two. Push opposite sides of the room away. Roll the shoulder blades back, lift your chin, lean your body towards the top of the mat. Keep that. Open up your palms, windshield wiper to the left. Left elbow on the inside of the left knee, left fingers on the inside of that left arch. Right fingertips stretch up. Modification is to take the elbow here, but don't sink it. So lifting up. My binders take your bind. Oh yeah, if you want to kick it into a birds of paradise, you know who you are, you go for it. But stretching up, stretching down, the minute you want out is the minute it starts. You guys have heard me say that before. So trusting your journey right here, right now. For three, two, and one. Come back into your center. Straighten the left leg, pause. Turn your left palm up, dance your fingertips up. Stretch up. Or just stretch through the left side body. Cradle your head with your hand, eye of the elbow up, up and over. Goddess Trikonasana. Close your eyes. Up and over. Trust for three, two, and one. Come back into your center. Turn your left toes to face the front, right toes to face the side. Bend deep into that right knee. Dip in. Guiding the left hip bone forward and down, pushing opposite sides of the room away. Roll the shoulder blades back, lift your chin, lean your body towards the front of the mat, open up the palms, windshield wiper to the right. Okay, modification now, one knee. My binders, take your mind. Okay, wherever you're at, you're perfect. Just be here now. Stretching up. I am patient. I'm strong. I'm determined for three, two, and one. Coming back. Straighten the right leg, pause. Right palm turns up, dance your fingertips up and over. God is doing it. Should feel yummy. Close your eyes. Take your bind if you want to bind. Three, two, three. Coming back into your center. Turn your right toes to face the front. Bring your right foot in to meet your left. Arms over top of your head. Bend your elbows and knees, reset, get tall. One sweet step to the side, back to your magic mountain. Just call it one shoulder, soften, jaw relax. Breathe in, and wave out. Breathe in, and wave out. Right, you can open up all the major joints now. Bring your feet together to touch. And then link some poses together to take it into a little flow. Okay, eagle pose, arms overhead, reach up, get tall. If we're in the same room, which our energy is still synchronized, believe it or not, moving like one. So on the count of three, wrap your right arm underneath left for eagle. Ready? One, two, three. Eagle 
Eagle Pose. Take your Eagle Bind or shoulders is a great option. Sit into your chair, weights in the heels. Transfer your weight to your left foot. Right leg up to the side, up and over, thigh over thigh. Smush it right over, so no leg or Token tippy, can be in the air, maybe it binds around. Working that right hip bone back so the shoulders and hips are like headlights. All right, here we go. Journey continues. Coming forward, nesting eagle. Squeeze your belly in. Come down nice and low, just like you're a tiny little creature. Change your focus, set your attention. You've got this. Be your own biggest cheerleader. Untie yourself for airplane pose. Arms open up right left. Right leg goes straight back, right and going down. You can kick it into a warrior three if you like. Okay, up to you. I am patient, I am strong, I'm determined. Tummy tight. Three, two, and one. Crescent, high crescent lunge. Lower the right leg way back. Airplane wings line. Pull right hip bone forward. High in the balls of the right toes. Bend deep in that left knee. Reach arms up. Open up your goddess arms up and Open up into your day. Prayer hands behind you. Interlace. This is your back bend. So energizing, so opening, so trusting. You know the mantra. I am enough. Three, two, and one. Bring it back into Shiva, just like we started. Charlie's Angels. Right knee down, arms in front, hover. Feel the stretch in the front right thigh. Back up. Down to hover. Heel up. Down to hover in the hold for five, four, three, two, one. Back up. Push off the right toes to meet the left. Reset. Take one sweet step to the side now. Inhale, wave in. Wave out. Inhale, some love. Exhale, gratitude. Love. Gratitude. Okay, bring your feet together to touch. Same thing, other side. Reach up. No thinking aloud. I've got you. Okay, let the energy take you. On three, left under right. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Shoo! Elbows up, shoulders back. You feel your shoulders and scalp below. <laughs> Sit into your chair, weights in the heels. Transfer the weight to the right foot, left leg, up and over, thigh with thigh. Working that left hip bone back. Token tippy. Can be in the air. Maybe binds around, but keep working that hip bone back. Sink deep and juicy into the hips. Yeah. Here we go. Nesting eagle. Squeeze your belly. Change your focus. Set your intention. Untie yourself air. Strong, powerful, the cast. Left hip bone down, shoulders away from the ears. Warrior three if you like. Three, two, and one. High crescent left, reach up. Pull the left hip bone forward, reach up. Open up your goddess arms. Up and down. Put your hands behind your neck. Or into your legs. I mean not. Three, two, and one. Shiver grip. Here we go. Left knee down, arms in front to hover. Inhale up. Down to hover. Inhale up. Down to hover in the hold for five, four, three, two, one. Back up, push off the left toes, come forward. Reset. Now. Collarbone, shoulders soft, and jaw relax. Wave in. And wave out. Soft. All the way through class, this 30 minute power hot class to come here now. Okay? Option to dance or to do standing up, up to you. Okay? We're only gonna do one set, so make it a strong one. Feet together. Arms overhead, reach up, get tall. I'm gonna teach dancers, but my Bikram bowers, you go for it. Right elbow in your right waist. We all start the same. Drop your palm down. Bend your right knee, take hold of your ankle from the inside, squeeze your thighs. I like corner finger thumb, knowledge and wisdom within you. Stretch up, get tall. Right shoulder back, left shoulder forward, right hip bone forward and down. Soften your low spine. Start your journey. Find one spot to focus on and don't move your eyes. Tell yourself, I can. I can balance. Keep guiding the right hip bone forward and down. Trust your journey. Strong. I am determined. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Let it go. One more. Never an end result, just the journey you're on. Okay? 
bringing so much focus and strength into your day or before you go to sleep even. Okay, feet together, arms overhead, reach up, get tall. Left elbow on your left waist, drop your palm down, bend your left knee, ankle and side, squeeze your knees. No chicken wing hanging out. Point your finger, thumb, dollar to whistle, stretch up, get tall. Left shoulder back, right shoulder forward, left hip going forward and down. Soften your low spine, start your journey. Harder you kick, the easier the balance. You've heard that before. Pretend there's a mirror in front of you and your toes invisible behind you. I can. I can balance. Try this. Effortless and easy in all that you do. I am patient. I am strong. I am determined. Five, four, three, two, one. Great job. Take a wide step on your mat, feet 45 degrees. Malasana yogi squat. Transition. Reach up, get tall. Hands into prayer and a heart center coming down. Elbows on the inside of the knees. Give yourself a little sway side to side. Tell your hips to chill. Hips relax. And come right down. Your knees, spread your knees wide, big toes touch, bum to heels, saddle pose. You can come into a fixed firm with knees together. Both are like sister brother poses, so up to you. You might use blocks or pillows underneath you if you need. Arms out wide to the side, spider hands, roll the shoulders back, lift your bum above your heels, open, 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 and melt back with your side. So as you melt back, you might come back to the elbows, you might come back to the shoulders. A great alternative pose for this is to come onto your back into a bridge pose, supported bridge pose. back. Close your eyes. Be here now. Take a great big inhale breath. Fill your belly up. Call a full yogi breath. Hold the breath for three, two, one, and then exhale. Squeeze the belly up. One more like that. Inhale. Belly expands and rises. Hold it for three, two, one. Exhale. Squeeze the belly up. Then use your hands to walk yourself back up and forward. Head comes up last. Downward dog. Don't pedal out. Right, left, right, left. Call it soft dog. Get the circulation going right through to the tippy toes. That last pose is amazing for any circulation in the knees, ankles, feet, and toes. All right, here we are. Camel pose. Make two fists on the inside of the knees. This is considered our peak pose of this 30-minute class to bring you a ton of energy, a ton of confidence, a ton of healing and gratitude into your life. Hands a little spine, just like the first back bend we did standing. Guide your hips forward, roll your shoulder blades back, lift your chest and heart up and over. Camel stress. As you go back, same thing. Keep your neck safe. Let you feel great. You might want to tippy toe the middle fingers. Lift the chest and heart. Okay, make sure you don't lean back on the heels and the hands. Hips forward, chest up. You know the mantra. All you have, all you need is in you now. The answer is the guidance, the courage. I'm enough for five. Four, three, two, and one. Hands in the low spine, head comes up last. Sit your bum down on your heels. Put your left hand on your heart, right on top of your left. Close your eyes. And notice how your heart is pumping, how it's speaking to you right now. Inhale love. And exhale gratitude. Inhale love. word. You guys know it. Sarah, I love you. Santosha. Contentment and gratitude for all that you have, all that you are in this moment right here, right now, keeping our community together with so much love and gratitude. Santosha. Make your eyes open. Shift your hips over to the side. Swing your legs around out in front. Little karate chop hands underneath the knees and lift up. You're gonna come up into a little boat if you like, or heels down, come all the way onto your back for thread the needle pose. Raise your right leg up, right ankle left. Get your lace underneath that left knee, relax your shoulders, close your eyes. Take an inhale breath. Exhale, guiding, you feel that stretch in the outer right thigh, taking pressure off the low spine. 
to wipe the legs to the left a little bit if you need. Give it to me easy. Lower the left leg to be straight, bend your right knee into your chest, interlace the fingers underneath your right knee, take an inhale breath, squeezing in and down, wind removing, do it strong and intentional for five, four, three, two, one. Hand on your bend knee, wrap your knee to the left, turn your head over the right, there's your spine twist, detoxify, but let all the good stuff. Who's your daddy? Reach your left leg up, thread the needle, left ankle, right knee, thread through his foot. Relax your shoulders, close your eyes. Take an inhale, breath. And exhale, guiding in. Three, two, and one. Lower the right leg to be straight, bend your left knee into your chest. Take an inhale, breath. And exhale, squeezing in and down. Five, four, getting into the descending forward. Three, two, one. Hand on your bent knee, wrap your knee to the right, turn your head over the left. There's your spine. Give yourself a little rock side to side if you like. You might straighten your legs and just choose your own adventure. You might bring your legs together. You might rock up into a shoulder stand or a plow. Whatever feels most natural for you. To prepare for your final magic. Your stillness, your shavasana. ready. Take your heels out to the top corner of your mat. Palms face up. Even take an inhale breath. Roll your shoulder blades in underneath your heart. Even butterfly your legs. Whatever feels most natural for you. And think of it as this beautiful body scan of gratitude from the tips of the toes to the crown of your head inside of the body. Nowhere to go. Nothing to do. Inhaling love. Softening into gratitude. Big inhale breath through your nose. The big exhale through your mouth. You can turn your head side to side. Give your fingers and toes a little wiggle, big stretch over top of your head. Bring your knees into your chest. Give yourself a little hug, even a rock side to side. To find yourself into seated position, facing the front, just like we started with palms up on your thighs. Let all of that amazing energy for this last half hour settle. Going back to your word or your intention that brought you to your mat today for this time. The happiness in your life depends on the quality of your thoughts. So putting all this good stuff in for this last half hour is so powerful. Throw your hands into prayer and to heart center. Going back to your word one more time. Thank yourself for showing up. Take an inhale breath. Cleansing exhale. Bow your chin into your chest, into your heart, and raise your thumbs to your forehead. Namaste. I love you. 